this is just a uh, quick video um, I have this set of images that I want to upload to Shutterstock for sale and I'm gonna go ahead and use my program Metaphoto AI to get that done um, so let's navigate to the folder I'm okay so I'm in the folder I'm gonna open up the metadata panel so I'm gonna press control M and that opens that up so I have a set of 35 images in this directory um, let's go ahead and get those keyworded so I'm just gonna say batch generate that's gonna open up the um, batch job panel and you can see it's already starting the generation process and we already have 10 images completed and another 10 done and should be done in no time so we only have five left and just like that we have 35 images keyworded uh, described and titled um, now I'm gonna generate the categories separately um, and I only intend on putting these on Shutterstock, so I'm going to generate categories only for Shutterstock. So I'm going to select all of them, Control A, and I'm going to come over here to the Shutterstock category, and I'm going to say Generate Categories. And it's going to go ahead and generate uh, categories only for Shutterstock for these 35 images. And it should be done now. <laughs> so just like that, we have categories generated for all 35 images, just like that. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and, and uh, let's see, I'm going to go ahead and export these. Yeah, just for Shutterstock, and it's going to export into current directory. You can see it right here. So let's open up that directory, and it's in done. All right, so there we can see we have our Shutterstock CSV file. If I preview, you can see it's all there. Categories are all um, where they should be. You can see all of the keywords here. And yeah. So let's go ahead and get these uploaded to Shutterstock. So I'm just going to select all of them and just gonna drag those over actually I do have to open up a upload thing here just drag them over and I think Shutterstock has a bug because it's only 35 images but it thinks that I'm uploaded more than a hundred um, they should uh, fix that. All right, so those are uploading. You can see the progress here. And all right, so while that's uploading, um, let me just look over the ones that I want to submit because. Some of these are similar and sometimes Shutterstock is picky in terms of, you know, submitting similar images. So I'm not going to submit all of these at once. Um, okay, so that's done. So let's go ahead and upload the CSV file such that um, our categories are also um, imported. So upload CSV and send my pictures folder and there we go upload and it'll be done in a second so let's see all right so 35 uh, rows processed successfully no errors close I'm just gonna do a quick refresh all right so if I click on one of these you can see we have our categories here you can see categories are all good and 
yeah so we have categories for all of these and appropriate categories let's see so yeah perfect and let me go ahead and select some of these and then we're gonna uh, submit them and actually let's see that that yeah those are sufficiently different yeah I'm pretty much gonna submit all of these okay yeah and submit that one all right so we have the images selected and I'm gonna go ahead and submit let's submit those all right so two of the images were flagged um, it seems like I, I need five minimum words apparently okay so we could fix that in Metaphoto AI by simply um, ensuring that we up um, the amount of characters. And yeah, so if I was to redo that by upping the um, amount of characters that I have set, then that would solve that issue. Um, so let's just put on uh, one more word on this. Let's say for uh, Christmas, and that one is good. And for this one, what's the problem? Hand peel and juicy Clementine uh, next to window, <laughs> and uh, I guess peeling and Eden. Uh, it's not good okay so those two are set let's um, resubmit those uh, submit okay so perfect so just like that we have 29 images that are waiting to be processed and those should be processed in no time um, Shutterstock is generally quick about um, processing the images that you submit all right so yeah so that's how quick it is to uh, submit images using metaphoto AI um, quickly you know generate categories and whatnot you know uh, if you're using a different agency you can easily generate categories for those agencies so if I wanted to generate categories for let's say dreams time I could um, select them all and say generate categories for dreams time and it's gonna go ahead and do that really quick um, so let's see and it should be done in now <laughs> all right so just like that for 35 images we've generated um, three categories for dreams time for each of these images um, so yeah perfect um, so in the spirit of the holidays I am putting out a promo code for Metaphoto AI 20% um, off uh, so if you want to get in at at a lower rate you can do that now by using the promo code uh, holiday 20 at checkout to get 20% off all right so until next time have a good one